What materials make wind turbines turn? Why are hybrid vehicles so clean? And what makes smartphones so smart? For all these modern technologies and more, there are rare earth elements. Quest Rare Minerals, an advanced Canadian rare earth investment. The Strange Lake Rare Earth Element property is located near the Quebec Labrador border, almost 220 kilometers northeast of Shefferville and 125 kilometers west of the Voises Bay nickel copper mine. The project covers 42,700 hectares. Within this area, two mineralized zones have been identified the B zone and the main zone, as well as several areas of elevated values such as A, SLG, Aperna, and B East. In 2008, an airborne survey identified a 2.2 kilometer by 500 meter radiometric anomaly 2.5 kilometers east of the main zone. This new area, now known as the B zone, contains the bulk of the known mineralization on the project. 256 exploration drill holes have been completed in the B zone, delineating a known mineralized area measuring 1500 by 750 meters and mineralized to a depth of 325 meters. In January 2012, Quest reported that new drill results from the project continue to confirm consistently high-grade, horizontally lying near-surface resources, rich in both heavy and light rare earths. This project is particularly rich in terbium, dysprosium, neodymium, yttrium, niobium, and zirconium. Drill hole BZ11218 intersected 144.4 meters grading 1.14% TREO. Multiple high grade intersections of between 1.12% and 6.11% TREO over thicknesses of between 2.34 meters and 144.3 meters characterize all holes drilled into the zone. These intersections are contained within a large mineralized envelope ranging between 95 and 147 meters thick. Drilling has proven that mineralization remains open at a depth of 325 meters to the south, southeast, north, and northeast. In April 2011, the company released an updated resource estimate for the B zone. The zone hosts an indicated resource of 140 million tons, grading 0.933% TREO, 1.93% zirconium oxide, 0.18% niobium pentoxide, 0.05% hafnium oxide, and 0.08% beryllium oxide. A further inferred resource of 89.6 million tons has also been identified. It is estimated that heavy rare earth oxides, considered to be substantially more valuable, represent 40 to 51 percent of the TREO in the B zone. The mineralized system is capped by a core pegmatite dominant zone of mineralization that will provide higher grades of rare earths in the early years of production. The 2010 preliminary economic assessment for the B zone envisaged a 25 year mine life with total capital costs of $563 million that can be paid back in just four years. The 4,000 ton per day conceptual plan would generate cash flows of up to $368 million per year and almost $8 billion over the life of the mine, an internal rate of return of 36.4% and a pre-tax net present value of $1.41 billion at a 12% discount rate with strong net present value metrics at discount rates of up to 20%. Quest Rare Minerals is poised to be a potential long-term provider of critical heavy rare earths to world markets. Efforts have now transitioned to tightly spaced infill drilling in an effort to upgrade more of the resource to reserve categories. Quest plans to complete a pre-feasibility study by H2 2012 that will more accurately depict the revenue model for the potential mining operation. Quest remains on track for production startup by 2017.